All right, let's kick this into life, shall we? How much of my base has been murdered since I last logged on? Because it's been a week and I only had five days of power for my defenses. Survey says... Minigun drones are attacking me. Uh, power's fine. The cannon's going for it. Let's get up there and help it out. Lag. Oh, no. Seems, seems it murdered them nicely. Good job, gun. Good job. Ow, I forgot to turn my jetpack on. What? Oh, no. Something horribly messed up with my controls. They are not behaving. I think this is iRacing putting its own profile on my G13. So two seconds while I ought to have out to fix this. Profile we're running thing. Yeah, iRacing hard. Bugger off. And default, set of consistent, my own usual control scheme. All right, there we go. My jump button is my jump button. My jetpack turned on. Okay. Right now, there was one of those annoying spider things over here by the corpses that I'm trying to loot. There he is. Loot the hell out of these two. Control devices, cables, electronics. Oh, these have all got new symbols. Patch has changed what things look like. To actually be pretty damn cool. The other thing I know that got added in the recent patch was the fibre that I've been struggling to find. Apparently you can now grow yourself if you can find a seed of it, of course. Now the other thing the observant among you will have noticed is there's no background music. And the reason for that is, after our long discussion last time, where I said I couldn't play, uh, for quote, better quotes, better music because of copyright claiming and you know just general popular music will be claimed to hell uh turns out the in-game music from this game is also copyright claimed to hell because the developers licensed it to put in their game but didn't license it for replay by other people so that was nice of them so episode one managed to get away with it somehow Every episode after that, however, has now got a nice copyright claim on it. I left them up because I didn't want you guys to lose content, but um, going forwards, there will be no music because, you know, I actually want to not give free money to someone else. At the point, I need to turn on the rest of my base. There we go. So given that this should have run out of power several days ago, I'm guessing the server was down for a period. Probably during the patching time. So I managed to get away with that. Right. Uh, what we got? What we got? What we got? I need a healing station thing. I even unlocked it though. Uh, be after the clone bay thing. I'm basically missing blindly. There, so I need level 10. We are not quite level 10. Let's go find something to shoot, shall we? Damn, it's got dark. There we go, you'll do.
Nasty spider. Still not quite enough to actually level me. Some of those Talon Guardian guys up on the hill there. I don't actually have enough bullets to kill them, I don't think. you will do. He's bugged out and should be running away. That was all I wanted. We'll leave him alone now. Point. Did we empty all of the hydrogen out of here? No. I was asking, where's the server hosted? It's hosted on a friend's PC in Norfolk. He's got a blade server he hides in the corner of his house. Gumby, you'll know who it is. I'm not going to give any more details for the rest of the audience. Um, right, what was I doing? Ah, yeah, I leveled up, that was it. So, let's unlock the medic station. Could unlock different turret. Ah, I'm not in base. Okay, more like it. Um, turrets. Air bay. Where was the automated miners? I did level 12 for that, okay. Can get the large Promethean fuel pack though, that's worth having. Large fuel tank, possibly. Although for now I won't worry about it, same with the generator. I'll keep my points just in case I need something else. Anything under tools? Nope. Weapon really worth worrying about. I have to start grabbing all of this small vessel stuff soon because I'm going to want to build myself a ship. But right now, getting the base kind of finished and working is, um, you know, slightly higher priority. Ah, my um, my stakes went rotten. Fiber I'm still missing. We definitely need silicon at some point. Can I build one of those medical clone bay things now? Or yes I can. Excellent. Uh, someone's asked, how big of a ship am I going to make? Initially, I will make quite a small sort of fighter craft kind of thing because it's really helpful for getting around the planet to get to resource nodes and stuff quickly. Um, you know, I'll go big once I go to make the carrier to go into orbit. Now we can stand in here and heal up nicely. Also, when we die, we can respawn here now, I think, because this acts like a cloning station. You don't need both a cloning station and a uh, medic center. All right, how are we doing? Plenty of iron. Silicon's not amazing. Arrestrum's a rare ingredient, so I'm not too bothered about that being low. Neodymium's pretty rare as well. It's up on the moon. We will have to go get some. Copper's fine. What do we do with making that Prometheum? Got even more iron down there. Yeah. Where's the cobalt? Are we nearly out of cobalt. Looks likely. Lithium's another one up in space that we can get. 
Uh, Zascosium is another rare one. It's not even on this planetary system. We have to go completely out of this system to go get it. Oh, yeah, low on cobalt. Probably do some mining of it just to top up the supplies a little bit before I go off on a wander. But I'm going to need more ammo. Get some of that built. While we go get some cobalt. Someone's asking, when is Mountain Blade 2 coming out? Um, if you can't put that question into Google and find the answer, why do you think I would have any more information? If I did have the answer and it wasn't released publicly, I wouldn't be able to tell you, because I'd be under uncertain and non-disclosure agreements. In resource mining, yep. It's not Mountain Blade 2. Warband was Mountain Blade 2. There was still an original game called Mountain Blade. Uh, Banner Lord is Fire and Sword as well. It's probably technically three or four, depending how you want to class Fire and Sword. Go too mad because cobalt you don't use in huge quantities. Google has the answer to most of the questions I get, sadly. One of my favorite websites is Let Me Google That For You, where you punch in the exact question that they've asked, then link them the link it gives you. If you've never seen that website before, go check it out. It suits my sarcastic mentality quite perfectly. Uh, someone's asked, can you make space stations? Yes, you can. The building blocks that you use to build the base down here, you literally just go up into space and put them down. Exactly the same. Obviously certain things are a lot more difficult up there because there's no water for you to generate oxygen from and you most certainly do need oxygen in space. So you will still have to make trips to and from the a planet of some variety to, um, to top up the oxygen. Although they have recently put in a, like resource asteroids in the asteroid belt around the world I don't know if water's one of them. I, I don't remember seeing anything mentioned about that. But, you know, I could fully imagine them putting in ice asteroids, if you like, so that you can get access to uh, water in space. We ran out of something there. What did we run out of? It's likely magnesium. Yeah, magnesium. Could do a run down there as well now. Uh, somebody's asking, are there any games I'm looking at? Conan, Warhammer, Sanctus Reach, etc, etc. Uh, Sanctus Reach... I have a, a bad relationship with Slytherin games. I want to like them. I just don't. Who the hell's the skate pod is that? There's someone else in the server. Can't remember who, how you see other players. Um, Conan. I'm sure I said this in the Rocket League game the other day. It's a fun con game. They will copy 90% of another game, introduce a million new bugs, stick Conan as a skin over the top of it, and then run out of money and promptly bugger off before they actually get it to a workable state. That's their general modus operandi for absolutely everything they seem to do. So I will be going nowhere near that until it is in a lot more finished state, if it ever gets to such a state.
I don't remember the key seeing other players scoreboard B. Nope, I'm the only one on here. I have no idea where that escape pod came from. Because normally they disappear pretty rapidly after the player, you know, lands. They don't... Crap. They don't tend to hang around. Get some magnesium because we're going to need to make some ammo for the guns. Either mine or the bases. Does this game work on Mac? I have no idea. Uh, Google? Essentially, I don't have a Mac, so I don't really track any kind of information of relating to Macs. The same with does this work on Linux? I have no idea. Got some magnesium. Get out there and get back. Oh, Scumby. You're a legend. He's uh he's put a let me Google that for you link into the the chat. Or he's tried to, but I think it may have been blocked because I don't allow links to be posted in my chat. And even though he's an admin, it still won't let him do it. In fact, it wouldn't even let me post links in my chat because YouTube. That quality logic of YouTube's right there. Couldn't possibly let the person who owns the damn thing post what they want in their own chat channel. Magnesium. Um, ammo, ammo, ammo. Let's do... No. Ten of each. Someone's asked what other Warhammer faction will I play? I've probably not going to go back to it until the uh, the next one comes out now or if there's a decent DLC that comes out maybe but I need to find fiber so I can build my grow plant area but it really needs daylight for me to see the plants that I need to pick up um Apparently under attack by drones, but again, that doesn't seem to actually be happening. Now, is there a seed for... Fiber. Yes. So if I can find a fiber, I can get a sprout, which will then give me an infinite supply of fiber. Probably don't need too many of them. Maybe three. I've got a three by three grid, so I've got nine squares available. So if I make three fiber and make the others food. And then we're going on a silicon hunt once I've got enough ammo. Yeah, so now you need fibre for the grow spot, so obviously I have to find enough of it to get a grow spot. I'm liking the new uh, icons they've put in for some of this stuff. 
but that looks a lot more like electronics than the weird little grey box thing they had before. Uh, someone's asking you put lights outside your base? Yeah, you can put lights around everywhere. Once I'm not concerned about my lack of resources, I will probably light the whole place up so we won't have these crazy dark shadows in here either. But when there's a complete lack of silicon in the area, until I find a supply of it, I'm reluctant to go building what is effectively cosmetics. What do I think the next Total War game will be? Warhammer 2. You may see something else before Warhammer 3, but pretty much guaranteed to be Warhammer 2. Although Arena is likely to release back to possibly beta status before that comes out. So I guess technically Arena would be the next War uh, Total War game. Take that much with us and we'll leave this slot here as a reserve stash. Silicon may be the most abundant mineral on Earth, but one, we're not on Earth, and two, just because it's abundant doesn't mean it's in such quantities that is easily salvageable. You need a highly concentrated area of it to be worth mining, and 90% of the places on the planet are it's there in tiny little, like, slithers of sand that are completely uneconomical to harvest. It can be as abundant as you like, it's still not useful. Alright, there's the green fog cloud of uh, instance loading. We don't find anything this side of that. Once we cross over it, we might find something. Oh. Another iron deposit. We found all the iron deposits, basically. Well, there's a base. How hostile it is, is the real question. Drone base, well, that answers that. I think it is. Nope, that's sugar cane. Study plants. Aloe vera. Somebody wants the mic up, up a tiny amount. I've just slid the slider up a little bit. Let me know if that's enough. It's on Spaceport Mark 1 and the village. I'll right, we'll go investigate the village on foot, I think. Not sure if the village is hostile or friendly. Alien insect. 
Cobalt. Right, so that's what spawners look like. You'll find those in bases. And this is spawning Talon Guardians, who are the neutral protective guys. So we should be alright being here. Something didn't sound happy there. Ah, something else is spawning in this village with them. Yeah, they look less friendly. I seem to remember this about the village, actually. Most of it's neutrals. And you've got containers that are worth looting in the, the houses there. But it spawns these nasty crawlers. Bike on my hotbar. Another base out there. We haven't identified. The sugar cane. Minigun drone. It'll probably hurt a hell of a lot more than the rocket drones because I'm less likely to be able to dodge it. But we'll give it a try. 